We're back with another video. You're watching the Sean Nicholas channel. We get into a ton of super treasure hunts in this video. It's very exciting. Stick around. Also, tomorrow I'm going to be doing a whatnot show, July 4th and also July 5th as well. Tons and tons of giveaways. I'm selling off most of my carded stuff. I'm just going to keep the stuff that I want. I have way too much stuff in my collection. It's time to let some stuff go so I can make some room in the new Hot Wheels room so I can do new stuff. So uh, if you guys want a piece of my collection, make sure you join the Whatnot Show. Book it. Also, too, if you have not joined Whatnot, use the link in the description. You'll get free $15 to spend on the Whatnot Show. Um, all the giveaways on Whatnot as well are free shipping. You don't have to pay a dime. All you have to do is hit a button to enter and uh, you're good to go. So it's pretty much a no-brainer. Why not join, right guys? So links in the description, free $15. Enjoy the video. Just found two M2 box. We'll see if we can keep our luck from the last two videos. We found a lot of these M2 chases. We got the 164 scale M2 machines auto haulers and the 164 scale M2 machines auto drivers. Let's get them cracked open. Let's see what we got here, guys. We have not seen this set. So there's gonna be two of each model. First up, we got the 1974. We got two of those, nice looking car. We have two of the GMC 100 step side, both regulars on that one. Now, 9,600 piece on that and 750. There could have been a chase on that. Now, I believe there's only going to be one car in the set that could be a chase. 9,600. See, there couldn't be a chase of this one. Plus, they're both regulars. Put that to the side. And last, we have another 9,600. No chance for a chase. So, typically, there's only one car that you can find that will be a chance at a chase all right we got to find out where this goes i'm going to put them up and we're going to go through that next box we are in the auto hauler box spam i think we've seen this set before the spam is the one that could be a chase 750 and i believe the other one there's no shot at a cha uh, chase that does not look like a chase we have another spam right here there might be three of the spams per box does not look like a chase we've seen this set the next one's going to be the chevy set and the orange for those of you who did not watch the last video that's what it looks like we have another chevrolet i always crack them open there's the mercury set there's the chevrolet set i always just check them and there's another mercury set right there so no chase two spams in the set those are both regulars we're gonna put them out and I believe they go right here. I just got handed an open case like this and I swear you not, look at that. A super treasure hunt right there on the top. It's got a bent uh, card right there. So this is definitely gonna be an opener, but oh my goodness, it never gets old finding a super treasure hunt. We now have two of these uh, Audi super treasure hunts. TH right there on the side, such a beauty. Love the paint on it. Uh, let's look through the rest of the case here. I'm curious because it looks like uh, one of the employees put out maybe half the case there and left a super treasure hunt in there for us. How exciting is that? Super, super cool. Get it? Super. Oh, my God. Are you kidding? Oh, my God. Two super treasure hunts? Get out. Get out. Oh, my God. I'm freaking out right now, guys. I'm shaking. I'm shaking. Holy cow. Holy cow. We are scored big. Um, so hyped. What if we find three in here? That would just be <laughs> ridiculous, guys. Ridiculous. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. All right, guys. Doesn't look like there's really anything else in here that interests me except for these two beauties. All right. Let's move on. Two premium boxes right here. This is going to be pop culture, if I had to guess. And this is going to be the Boulevard non-numbered set. We know that because of the A on there. And I'm pretty sure that's the pop culture. We've gotten to one of those cases. I'm really hoping it's the R34. It's also got another Nissan in there. Some pretty cool cards. Let's get them cracked open. Let's start off with the Boulevard. Yep, this is that non-numbered set. We've seen the whole set. I've showed it in previous videos. Let's go ahead and crack open what I believe is pop culture. Let's get into it right now. Let's see what it is. 
Pop Culture R34. Such a cool car. Whenever you see a Nissan R34, definitely worth something to grab. It's very nice. Love seeing the Gran Turismo. We've seen this whole set. There's also another Nissan in here. We got the R35, the Nissan GTR Nismo GT3. Such a cool car. Personally, I really like the Dumber and Dumber Mutz Cuts van. I think it's so cool, the dog car. Love it. Absolutely awesome. We found two more of the Boulevard boxes. We're gonna go ahead and put them out. The pegs are kind of dry, so let's get them cracked open. They are the non-numbered, the A set. So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna put these out for somebody lucky. We're gonna put all the non-numbers out. Super happy, I already have those set. Super cool cars, pegs are gonna be super full. This is our first time getting into the new Fast and Furious set. I'm pretty sure this is the new Fast and Furious set. So let's get it open and check it out. So I'm curious if they have a metal base. Wow, that's nice, they have three of the Mazda RX-7 does not have a metal base. Pretty cool set. Here is the complete set. We're gonna check it out. Up next, we got the 1970 Chevelle SS and that one has a metal base. That's really cool. Very, very clean. Got a matte color to it. Up next, we have the 1968 Dodge Charger. Plastic base on that one. There's three of the set. The 1950 Chevy Fleet Line that has a plastic base. Got a barn fine look to it. Not sure which movie each one of these are from. It doesn't say anywhere on the card which one it's from. So we got four. So there's one more car we're missing. Here it is. And we've seen this in premium too. And this one, is that a metal base? This is pretty heavy. It looks like a plastic base, but... We've seen this in premium. And I thought it was going to be a one-hit wonder, honestly. Have we seen two colors of it? I can't remember. Here is the complete set. The only one that has a metal base is going to be the 1970 Chevy Chevelle SS. Here is going to be the most popular one, the Mazda RX-7. Such a cool set. Happy to find it. Look what I just found, guys. Now, are we still finding the Porsche set? Or is this a new set that we haven't seen yet? I can't remember if the H is something new or if that is the Porsche set. I have no idea. But if it's the Porsche set, I really hope we get a chase. Let's get this thing cracked open and see what's inside. We got the box cracked open and it is the Stars and Stripes. This has the 2020 Ford Shelby GT500. This has been out for a while. I haven't seen this set personally. 2013 SRT Viper, pretty cool. Uh, what else do we have in here? We have the 2013 Copo Camaro. Do any of them have a metal base? It seems like all of these cars so far have plastic bases. Here is a plastic base, 2018 Dodge Challenger SRT Demon. And we have a Corvette. There's five in a series that has a plastic base. Pretty cool to see a Corvette. That looks, that looks good. It's got tampos on the back and also on the front. So that is the complete set right here, guys. And it's not the Porsche set. There's no chase in this set. Now there's two Corvettes. There's two Dodge Demons. Oh, wait. Yeah, there's two 2020 Ford Shelbys. There is two of the Viper and two of the Camaro. So there's going to be two complete sets all right i just found 164 scale hot wheels monster trucks hopefully we'll find a treasure hunt we have not found one in a very long time so let's get this thing cracked open and hope there's a treasure hunt all right we got the box cracked open doesn't seem like there is a treasure hunt boo we've seen this set probably three times on the youtube channel no treasure hunt maybe there's not a treasure hunt in this mix all right let's go ahead and put them out because they are completely dry there's only one on the pegs over there and it looks like they go right there so i knew they got car culture and i had them scan it and they had 10 that got delivered so i came here at six in the morning at opening they didn't have put out and i thought overnight was gonna put it out but they didn't so i asked the guy and he brought all these out now i believe this is gonna be the stars and stripes set 
Uh, we've seen that, the H case, and then I believe this is gonna be the new Fast and Furious set, Premium, and then this is probably uh, Slide Street. So let's get all these open and see what we found. Wow, it's the new Slide Street, check that out. First up, we got the Nissan uh, 240SX. That's a 14, such a cool set here at the back. It's got all the cars in the set. Up next, we have the 2018 Ford Mustang uh, RTR Spec 5. Very cool artwork, very nice car as well. Up next, we got what would be the Chase, but we didn't find the Chase. Now, if you find a black one that says zero of five right here, you are one lucky dude. We got the 2023 Toyota GR Corolla. Pretty cool. Love the white wheels on that one. Up next, we have the LB Works, basically Liberty Walk Works Lamborghini Huracan. Very nice. Very nice casting. And last, we are going to have this 2023 Nissan Z. Very nice set. Let's get into uh, this case right here and see if that's the new Hot Wheels Premium Fast and Furious. Yes, it's the new Fast and Furious Premium Premium set. Let's see what we got. We got the Land Rover Defender 90. That looks very cool. Nice recolor on that one. We've seen it before. The Toyota Land Cruiser FJ43 with the chrome wheels along that red paint. Looks amazing. Not, very nice set. Here is the complete set. We see some repeats in there, some recolors. Oh, uh, what a beauty. The Porsche 911 Carrera RS 3.8, finally premium. We've seen this in uh, main lines a bunch. We had a bunch of different recolors of that. Mercedes-Benz 300 SEL. That looks very nice with the four-door. Love the look on that one. And last, we're going to have one that we've seen many times. The custom Acura Integra sedan gsr with those chrome wheels very small wheels very nice looking but yeah we've seen this one many many times here is the complete set very nice let's get into these cases i believe this is going to be the stars and stripes so let's check it out yes stars and stripes now we've seen this whole set i've showed it in the previous video so there's no need to open it and it's the H case, and so is this one. So no need to open that. It's going to be the Stars and Stripes. I'm going to go ahead and put them out. Uh, it was very nice of the guy to go in the back and pull these cases for us so we can showcase them and open them. Uh, I was really hoping to get a car culture shape. Unfortunately, we did not. But, hey, all part of the hunt game, and you got to hunt to try to find those chases. All right, let's put them out. Just found this box on the pallet. I asked the manager if I could go through it, and he said yes. It's a G case, guys, so... We know what's in this case. We've been over it. Here is the treasure hunt right there. But that's not really what we're looking for. I'm going to put that to the side. Um, oh, yeah. Awesome. Honda recolor in white. That is pretty cool. We're going to flip it around and hopefully find that Audi super treasure hunt. Let's see. All right. Let's see. There's the previous. There's the Audi. No super treasure hunt in this case, unfortunately. So... We're gonna go ahead and move on. Just found an M2 machine box. That's right, we got the model kit. So let's get it open and see if we got a chase. There's pretty much no model kits on the peg. So let's fill it up and see what's in the box. We are in the box. Let's see what we got here. First up, we got, what is this? The 1965 Ford Conaline delivery van. Pretty nice. Now there's gonna be two of each in the set so we got another one right there both non chases up next we have the 1972 uh dodge truck that looks very cool i love how you can uh put the wheels on there and all that good stuff there's gonna be two per box right there all right let's move on Ooh, i see a chase i see a chase and it's a volkswagen here's the regular the volkswagen uh beetle deluxe that's pretty cool. Let's check out that chase, shall we? Woo! What a beauty, guys. We scored big. 1953 Volkswagen Beetle Deluxe. You can tell it's a chase. It's got the gold trim on it, and it's got a gold stand on it. We'll compare it to the regular right now so you guys can see the difference. On this one, it's got a blue stand. That one's got a gold, and it's got gold wheels. 
and it's got a different color screwdriver as well and the trim on the bumpers are different as well so pretty obvious especially if you can see the other one here you'll know it's a chase we got lucky all right we have another m2 machines model kit box right here and i also found a nascar authentics uh case right here we're gonna see if we can find a chase in it so let's get them cracked open we are in the box let's see what we got here we can already see from the side here if we got a chase it looks like all of them have regular bumpers we've seen this whole set so we're not gonna uh you know look through the whole thing i will put them out but we're gonna move this to the side and we're gonna check the nascar authentic case and see if we can find a chase that would be very exciting let's get it cracked open we are in the box let's see what we got here they have all these plastic wraps on here so it makes it kind of hard to look through them collect them all hmm usually it says like on this one right here it'll say look for the uh focus uh, factor chase piece so i don't see that on this one does that mean this set does not have a chase we're gonna check them anyway you can tell by the shiny paint kind of like a hot wheels super with the specter flame paint so we're gonna check them all we got boulevards falling in here and see if we can find anything with shiny paint maybe they removed which one to chase on the back maybe that list of cars right there are all the chase pieces that you can find so always want to check them all none of them look like they have shiny paint on them looks like there's two more left in the that looks shiny. Number 40. I think we just found a chase, guys. Yeah, that's definitely a chase. If we were to compare it to like paint on, we should had another one. See that shiny paint? Kind of like car paint. I and mean, that's just like a matte color. I think we just found a chase, guys. I'm gonna verify it. Look it up on uh, eBay. Look at people selling chase pieces and compare it to it, but that paint is definitely shiny. All right, I'm gonna check right now. Let's see what the last car indicates is. It's 24, Jeff Gordon. All right, I'm gonna verify it right now. All right, yes, that is a liquid chase, guys. How cool is that? I just verified it on eBay. They're selling for like 17 bucks. Not much, but pretty cool to find a chase, especially with that shiny color. I love it. All right, guys, I just found a e-case and we're at Dollar Tree. So let's get it cracked open and hopefully you find that super treasure hunt. We're looking for the Fiat. It's gold. Let's get to it. We're in the top of the case here looking through it. And I see the Nissan GTR. That's always good to see. We're going to see a gray one later this year. And I don't see anything else. I don't see the treasure hunt. Let's go ahead and flip it around and hopefully get that super. We're in the bottom. Ooh, hoo, 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 hoo. We did it, guys. We pulled the super treasure hunt TH right there on the side of the car. That gold paint looks amazing. There is that gold flame right there. Super cool. Let's check the rest of the case just because you never know what you'll see. We found that case with two super treasure hunts. It was obviously two dumps or two cases dumped into one, but amazing. All right, guys. And that's a wrap, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. Tons of new videos coming soon. Make sure you subscribe if you haven't already. And also bookmark my show on whatnot. Don't forget about that. Free $15 in the description. So make sure you click that link, sign up. You get free 15 bucks on the Whatnot Show. It's going to be July 4th and also July 5th. All right, guys, you know what I'm going to say. Don't forget to like and subscribe.